everybody, uh, Squad Nine is going to go with game number two in my CCL league with this chaos. I named all the players after players in my league. And uh, the first game was a draw. We lost two players to death. So, not the best. But we can persevere through that. They were beastmen. I'm going to buy them back. But probably play the loners for a little bit. But uh, I'm going to be in Discord with people in my league. So they'll be talking some and maybe rooting for their self or maybe rooting for other people in my league to die. I don't know, but uh, it should be fun. So, uh, I don't know. Let's see what happens. Uh, oh, no. 11.30 Wood Elves. $500,000 Jefferson Davis chair stolen in Selma, Alabama will be used as a toilet unless Confederate group meets demands email claims. Yes, sir. I mean, I have thoughts on this. <laughs> None of which really matter. But, yeah. Uh, my opponent's got a leveled war dancer with Frenzy, a thrower with, oh gosh, did he really waste it on accurate? No, dump, he's got dump off and pass on his thrower. And he's got a lineman with tackle, which Ooh, literally does nothing ways. against me. So this could actually be pretty good. Fuck, bro. Uh, I've got 70k petty cash. No bank, really. So, Am babes it is. Babes it is. Am I dead, bro? Do you have... Do you have the fear? Touch this load when you're just like... Am I dead? He has the peer. Nice. I respect it. So, who here took up magic recently and has never been to a live event? Oh, when GPs are a thing again, we're going to have to meet up somewhere. Yeah, yeah. Me, 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 me. The thing to do with GPs, though, if you're not, like, really, like, want to play, is go play side events. Oh, no, you don't play, like, the main event. I don't know about that. Like, you play side event, like, little quick three, four round tournaments, uh, play pickup games, cube, and decide where you're going to eat and drink that night. <laughs> well, yeah. Some of us enjoy playing the main events. But you can. I'm just saying, like, for your first event, and yeah. probably not your best to deal. That's uh, true. Also, like, considering we only get, like, two or three in the southeast within driving distance, like, usually it's the format, like, I care nothing about. Well, <clears throat> what city are you in again, Michael? Houston. Uh, he's got a couple more to choose from. You've got a couple more to choose from, uh, particularly if you're willing to drive up to Oklahoma City. Um, obviously, I'm a little bit closer to, like, anything they want to do in Tampa than y'all are, um, and I can still do the Atlanta stuff, you all get kind of the Nashville scene, that it's a little bit far for me. Uh, still, I'm telling you, if you really want to dig into, like, live magic tournaments for, for cash money and stuff, your best bets are living in the Northeast or California. I like this setup against uh, against war dancers and whatnot. Playing against woodies? Yeah. Kind of miss playing woodies. I miss having a heart attack every single time. I just have to <laughs> Please don't have another counter stall again. Please don't. I, I believe. I believe you don't have it. That that helps, I, I guess. Actually, check, haven't checked levels on anything. Oh my gosh, I'm retarded. My uh, the Discord levels were all the way down. So it just basically probably sounded like I've been talking to myself this whole time. I was like, that's probably why it's like always a little quiet on some of your replays. Holy well, shit, Gonzaga's losing. Good. Oh, really? Go Bears. 75 to 59. Go Did Bears. Did you see um, the last play that uh, 
Oh, the you almost half court shot. Them. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. They did good to get there. So. Let's go. Oh yeah, let's start off right. We'll just get clapped by the uh, block. Like, I'm gonna lose this guy because he had a counter spell for every time I had immersion ultimatum. Ah. Good. I milled this guy's Genesis ultimatum, Lamel. This is my first time. Like I had a counter spell for his counter spell, but he always just had enough mana to, you know, pay the cost. To be boss. Dropped. Fiery Emancipation. Taurus, you would control deals damage to a player. This is the first time I've streamed with this setup. I've got Blood Bowl running. Uh, I've got OBS. I've got Discord, streaming it to Discord, streaming it to Twitch. And I'm uploading a video to YouTube right now. And everything's just kind of doing it. It's pretty cool. I don't know why, but your 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 colors are a little bit washed out in Discord. Yeah, I see that on that. I'm not sure what that's about on my on my monitor. They're pretty great. So, but I see that in OBS as well. It's very washed out. I'm not sure. Maybe really, what I I'll look into that later and see if I can't change the the dis, the um, output color. I guess. Well, he's knocked over three Beastmen, two of which are loners, so, and then also Shane. So, eh, it'll be alright. And he's just making passes because, I mean, that's an L thing, I understand. Oh, uh-oh, five reroll. I won. I did it. I'm the coolest. Oh, he's starting the fouls early. This is kind of gross. <sighs> he got sent off on a stun fouling a loner. He deserves that. Positioning being fairly even, would you rather use your blitz with a Chaos Warrior with zero SPP or a Beastman on five? That depends on positioning of everything else, though. That's what I'm saying. Like, I've got literally got a Chaos Warrior and my five SPP Beastmen standing right next to each other on both sides of the field. Who are you planning on blitzing? Uh, I'm actually kind of just wanting to hit this guy with Tackle. Over here, just trying to get a good get a good hit and kind of collapse the side you, of the field and, and force them the other way. Either of those players. Yeah, and since the chaos warriors are square closer, like the follow up is going to be about the same amount of movement. You're more likely to get an injury from the evil. Oh, that's my bounty. I don't mm -hmm. like that. Um, I would use the chaos warrior because. You never know when you're going to need the extra range of movement you're going to get from the beast man, and he, yeah, will have that ability. That is a fair thought. So that being said, I think I'm going to blitz with you, Dickens. And you got me a push. Not exciting. I mean, it would have been a four. Strength attack anyways, but it would have pushed either way. Oh yeah, no, it was a push no matter who it was. I'm just saying. It was a double push, so yeah. 
not a lot to do there. Uh, I kind of just want to tie this guy up, to be honest. Because he, he's actually one of the few players that didn't have dodge, so... I remember now I turned my Discord almost all the way down because the last game that I, I was streaming, I was playing as Brian and he was chewing ice into his microphone. <laughs> I was like, are, are you chewing ice? He's like, yeah, I'm an ice chewer. I'm like, okay, cool. Take the slider all the way down. <laughs> like, I understand having to chew the ice though. Grab turn one, I concede. You've never it's known the joys of playing mill, I take it. My immersion ultimatum. There's something just so comforting knowing if you ever run into a life gain deck, and you're like, your life can be two million. It won't matter when you have no cards. Reminds me of the time I was playing my lyric combo um, against a life gain deck yeah. that had an infinite <laughs> life gain combo and he's like, I gained 2 million life and I am tapped and went, I do 3 million damage. <laughs> You're like, nice, uh, arbitrarily like, large number. You have to pick a number, sir. You are required to pick a number. Yep, it is true. Vanishing light, my cosmos elixir. How to ward answer? Feels good. Feels good. Of course, his armor didn't break. Let it break. My giant bear, giant snow bear, fucking slamp this man, giant snow bear. Give this man the big snow bear slamp. Alright, gentlemen, I'm tired. I'm logging off. Later, man. See you later, brother. 
Let's see, brother. No bear slam. Uh, none of those are my sweeps. Still lost to the mill deck just because of units. I couldn't get rid of them. I even killed Luros of the Dream Den. I stopped that shit. When he top decked all the right answers. Lamp him. Slamp. Slamp can play. Yeah, bro. I love. That my spirit of the Alder Guard has 11 attack. Just from Snowlands. Doomscar. That's not nice. No, don't surrender. I was having fun. Yeah. Jeremy, when I was rendering that, that last game, you know, my Chaos Warrior bites the dust on the go line. Yeah. I had to, like, uh, normalize the peak. I, like, took a cut of that, like, three-second clip and had to renormalize yeah. the audio so it wouldn't just, like, peek out everybody's eardrums. Because <laughs> on this, it's like, it just, the audio spiked so much. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to bring that down a lot, and it was still loud. So, got to work on that. Yeah, it's always like, it was like, I just went and listened to it, I was like, God, it's like really quiet. <laughs> yeah, and then, like, I, when I go into, um, on YouTube, like, it's fine, because I can just, like, normalize the peak, and it raises everything up, and it, it's fine, but when you have that one really peaky part, you're like, you gotta, you gotta just boost everything else, so. Yeah. Hopefully it's better this next time. What I hate about OBS is, like, you can literally change nothing, just open it back up, and all of a sudden, all your levels are just off. I didn't check this guy's record, but I don't know. I don't feel like he has a very great record, but we'll see. Oh, well, he just turned it over, so that's great. Good job, Shane. Let's we'll stand in there and take that button out. He got stunned, but it's okay. At the end of the turn. Are we doing any um, game-specific betting for the playoffs? Yeah, we'll have lines for each of the games, I think. Oh, cool. Yeah. Trying to decide if he wants to dump off. That's uh, what? No, sir. No boring flex. Not allowed. Boring flex is a jerk card for jerks, and I, I kind of like it to be honest. I so love. It's boring it's a good. It's good when it's on your side for sure. God, I hate. I hate having to. He had a guy with block and dodge, and I had no skills. It's just not fun. Hey, there's my emergent ultimatum. This is where we just kind of win the game on turn whatever it is. Wicked Wolf, whoa. Nope. Oh, it's a loner. Awesome. I didn't realize that. Guess we're taking the boat down. Sweet.
turn again. Sick. Yorion. Like I'm about to get elfed. Oh no, never mind. He doesn't have a reroll. Immersion ultimatum is so good. Ah. When your opponent doesn't counter two of them, it's so good. True. I had double shadows verdict in hand if this board got out of hand. I was I was cool in it that game. Not really sure about that, but it's whatever. Now I've got to hit the ball carrier with a loner again. Don't really want to do that, but. Hey, of course he's got dodge. Unlucky. break baby stun all right I have got a few stuns this, this turn so that's good all right KO to war dancer feels good So, he's down two players, and I'm still not feeling good about stopping him from scoring. He's getting the ramp off. I do not have any ramp. Just fail something. Just need a fail. Okay, Graven lore actually kind of fucking slaps no fellas. What's that? Um, five mana snow instant requiring three mana and then two blue. Um, scry X, where X is the amount of snow spent to cast this spell, then draw three cards. 33% fast? Yeah. Sure, go for it, man. 
hit Dude, hit missed all this. Behind the what? Steps. Okay, he just totally took a 33% pass, and uh, of course he rolled a, uh, a, a 6. It oftentimes results in scry 5, um, draw 3. For five mana. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I think double go for it to two die. The catcher with a chaos warrior is probably better than the 67% dodge and no go for it. Is that right? Two, I got two 83% or one 67%, and I've got a reroll. Like I got, I got to think. I it's one in thirty six. One in thirty six. Is it? No. Like I got to think. It's got to be better just to blitz him with the one guy and just not roll a one twice. But then I or I can do the one dodge out where I just got a two plus or three plus. These are the things I should probably know, but I do. Sky Nomad can also blink Mire Triton for more healing and more discard. Yep. Does he have the nope? He's putting Yorion. He's I'm liking Yorion a lot. <sighs> I guess I gotta reroll it? I don't possibly take the but I guess I gotta reroll it. Pal, thank you. Please go out of bounds now. And a stuff. That's big. Come on. Scatter, baby. Let's go. Okay, that is like probably the worst scatter for me, but it's not. Uh, maybe not. I've got people free to go get that. The tempting Devon card. Only one mana start. Tempting. Looks okay. Can binding. He didn't like either of those top decks. Does he draw the emergent ultimatum? Do I lose the game? Do I lose the mirror? Ah, I found my bear. I must find one more mana, and the ramp will be complete. We did stuff and things that turn. It's okay. The floor. Thanks. Oh man, I uh, I would like to draw a mana of any color, please. This man murdered my priest of the haunted edge. What the fuck? What? What the fuck? Uh, he stole my Valky. Oh, all right. Well, what the fuck? That's so unlucky. What the fuck? I could.
could have right. dealt with anything else. All right, guys. Uh, I think me and Seth are playing more a little after nine, but uh, I'll catch y'all on here about then. Yeah, brother. All right. All right see y'all later. See ya. Later, brother. So, yeah, so don't know how much of that y'all could hear, because I don't know how my Discord level is, but, like, I was in the big chat group, and they were playing Magic, so I wasn't seeing what they were doing, and they weren't really seeing what I was doing, so, anyway, we're just going to go this way, we've only got three turns, so, step one, pick up the ball, actually, no, that's not step one, I take it back. Step one, knock this guy over. And stay. Alright, armor breaks, let's go. Oh, I just need... Come on, come on. Uh, this guy can two die here. Okay, that push is fine. It's not great, but it's fine. Now we're going to try and get this guy. Big. We're going to stay and then I'm going to go up one. Okay, hey, yeah. that's one less person I'm going to worry about. Success. Can we throw it is the question. I think we can. Let's go. Okay, so we need this. Gotta reroll. Let's go. Inaccurate. Uh, gotta reroll that, unfortunately. Come on. Accurate one time. Oh, complete fail. Okay, well, it's in the middle. I should have sent. Uh, okay, so I. Do I have another? I mean, two turns? Okay, I can still score, but it's a lot harder now. So, yeah, it's a lot harder now. But I think that was kind of the order I needed to do it in, because uh, I obviously couldn't move um, Waltagore up until he had the ball. I probably could have laid the block on the War Dancer with Mr. Pig. Eh, that might have made things a little easier, but anyway. Uh oh. You should definitely push it on the ball. He might, oh, he's not pushing. Oh, well, that's a bad idea. And he got the pow, never punished. Wow. Hmm. Oh, and he's going to enjoy it. Nope. Seth, just get stunned. It's okay. Alright. Uh, he's doesn't have any players left on the pitch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's got eight players, and I've still got 11. If he's using his blitz on that, I'm pretty happy. Ends his turn. Cool, he's still got two players out of the play. He KO'd that guy. Yeah, this is, I mean, this is getting pretty, pretty one-sided, but the dice always swing, so you gotta be careful. Looking for thinking of blitz this guy. I just push him down here, I guess. Follow. Cool. Now oh, it's a loner. Why would you do it with a loner? Okay, I gotta push him on the ball. Uh, we're just gonna stay. Yeah. Of course. Of course. Of course. Okay, that 
one's fine. Okay, tell you what I'm gonna do before I try and pick this ball up is send this guy down field to see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, we're gonna do that. Take him downfield, stand this guy up, which I actually should have done a while ago. Gonna leave him standing over him in case he just does something stupid like stand him up. I think I can get three dice. Oh, okay, what is that? Stupid. I'm not being stupid. All right, that's what we want. Let's go. Okay, he's marked by a bunch, he's marked by a bunch. Let's just go here and pick up the ball. Easy, pick up the ball. Let's go. He picked it up. Sweet. Now, what can we do with this guy? Uh, yeah, I think we go over here. Do we go here? Um, actually, I think we go here because it marks a lot more people out. Let's go that way. Okay, so I'm going to hand off and a go for it away from scoring. Seems good. Also, it's very unlikely that they can score with five standing players or four standing players. That is a dodge you can do. It's not a bad, not a bad knockdown. He still has a lot of dodges to make. So that's cool. A little better. Wow. What do we get? We got a skull. Sweet. So I just clock him. Okay, I don't. Uh, I guess I could get a three die on somebody. And that's probably worth. Again, maybe not. Follow over. Okay, three down. Yeah, that's just two down. That's three down. Sweet. Of course, he has dodge. Okay. We have uh, we have tried to make the damage. They have no way of stopping this. Uh, I could be greedy and did the pass, but we're not going to do that. That sounds really bad. Come on. Two not one or twos. Failure. Thank you. Now, not a one. Not a one. Touchdown. Let's go. Let's go. Good old beast man roar. Let's go. So, I should have counted. I bet I got a lot of KOs up. He's actually only got one person out. I've injured nobody. We got one person back. Okay, so he's down three. I don't think he had, did he have the bench. So one, two, three, four. Yeah, he's down three. It's pretty good. And I get the ball. Yep, nobody out. We put the loners on the line. And go from there.
set up three. Okay, you're going on the line. Griffin's coming back here to maybe get the ball, maybe make a pass. Also coming back. Loners on the flanks. Big guys in the middle. Just make it a little harder for them to, just to blitz to come all the way down. Quick snap. Uh, not the opposite of a blitz, but pretty close. So we're going to move you in here. Move you in here. Uh, see if you can actually catch the ball. Seems good. Should move him up. Yeah. Okay, we're just gonna move you up. That works. Can you catch it? I cannot, and it goes back. Of course, it goes backwards. Why would it not? Slice some blocks. Come on, Pickens. Just knock somebody over. Stay. Now, Davis can three die on this guy and do nothing. Down the line we go. Follow, follow. Get rid of the dude all the way over there. Yeah, I guess I do. Three dies are important. Well, I'd have to blitz. Oh, why are you so bad at this game? Oh, it's catcher. Cool. Now I get a pal. Sweet. Mr. Pig. Hello. Success. Now I want a hundred percent, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it with my lover because reasons. They want to come a long way around to try and get. To this guy, I can't reach. Cool. Ninety-seven percent. Let's go. KO'd. Sweet. Didn't need any of the uh, assist there, so that's that's funny. Rolled nine though on the injury. Always good. Uh, enter. So it's one, two, three. He's got seven versus eleven. One of his war dancers is gone. And what we got? Lineman, 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 catcher. Oh, he got his, his war dancer one of the guys that got back. So he's got a catcher out. His war dancers are on the other side of the field. So I feel okay. I'm, my goal is to literally make a wall of chaos warriors here in the middle and just go this way. 
and just take out these two guys. He probably they probably won't stand up. They can, but whatever. He's got one. Re I, I noticed that his build included one reroll, so he obviously hasn't played too many games. I mean, not that that build's bad. I'm saying he hasn't played enough games to get bank to get another reroll. His build is actually kind of what you see. So does he have a half of this? He does have a pop carry. Oh, push, frenzy push. It's not good for you. That is the incorrect push. Now it's red eye. Wait, what? Oh, because he can't make a second block because he had to double go for it just to get there. Which is kind of bad for me because that would have been a two red die block and I would have probably got to knocking knocking this out of him. Okay, so they're just really cleaning that up for me. It could still happen and I just turned the ball over and they scored really fast. So let's hope that doesn't actually come out too. Currently, it's like one block, blitz, run up here, hand it off, go away. So, no trip here, be good. Trip, nope, nope, I'm fine. But he's still marked. I don't, don't know what that did. That is not what you want to do. I think got a pretty clear line is whether or not the dice will cooperate. Um, first thing I'm going to do like I said, make a nice wall of people here. All I have to do is push him. Push is fine. Got re-rolls. Push is fine. I'm going to push him away. Actually going to stay. Got no free blocks for you. Um, okay, no, I don't do that yet. Ah, it's so. Trying to make safe moves. Safe moves are good, but we like safe moves. Okay, push is fine, I guess. Follow. Um, more here. This part where I'm going to be greedy and make a pass because I kind of want the SPP. I want to level this guy up. It, I know it's an extra dice roll. I know it is. But at some point, I've got to get one SPP on him and let's get success. Now catch the ball. Thank you. See, that, that wasn't so hard, was it? Now we're just going to go off over here and be close to scoring soon. Almost too soon, actually. Okay, I've got. Uh, do, do, do. Um, I'm just gonna try and hit him. Even we got dodge. Even one's got dodge. Let's hit this guy. Pow. There, and we will stay. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. I think everything's okay. He's got seven players left, and um, one to go. was it that leveled? It was Griffin. Okay. I'm going to have to get a note to Griffin about he needs to uh, pick a level.
Nice dodge. I mean, he's out there by himself against the Chaos Warrior. So, yeah, it's okay. I still have all my loners, right? Yeah, he's probably, if he doesn't stand up, he's probably going to foul him, like, pretty, pretty hugely, just to say. Elf doing elf things. It's about to run out of time, though, is the problem. Uh oh. Did he click it? He did not click it. Okay. We are okay with this. Block that guy. Cool. Mac and Lillary just scored one, two, three, four, five. I wouldn't go for it to score. Yeah, it's probably okay. Uh, but I would like to uh, do some damage. Damage, please. This also may make him concede, which I'm kind of okay with. That's like free stuff. So I'm going to lay this block, make this foul, then score. Push. Pushes whatever. Follow. Okay. I can blitz over here. Three dice. Oh, he's a catcher. Yeah, we're going to clap him. Let's go. And nada. Okay. So we'll push him around there. Follow. And uh, now we're just going to make the one go for it. And hopefully, come on, Casey. Casey can do it. Let's go. Guys could wake up. No, two of them woke up. Cool. He's still down two players. Okay. Let's stay in this setup. not like the best kick. Uh, got across the line, though. We'll take it. Uh, actually, in the middle. Let's go. Yeah, I say let's go a lot. Sorry. It's, it's, it's a habit. But. Okay. Push him. So I did message, uh, I put a, in Discord a message for Griffin whether he wanted, if I don't roll a stat up, which I'm on a beast man, I think I would take, I'd take strength, obviously, I'd take movement, I'd actually take agility. Probably wouldn't take armor, just probably wouldn't do that. Um, so if I don't get one of those three, I told, ask him what, uh, what skill he'd like between block, mighty blow, and guard. I think that's like the only real defensible first skills for a beast man, so I say first skill, first earned skill. Okay, he's trying to, I guess he just drops him. No, he's going to push him. The full pal. Oh no, 
Hold on. The vast system. Come on, Davis, you can do it. Fine, him. I actually bring one of these guys over to tie up both these players. Um, I mean, that's okay too, but like I can move them back now. If you tie them up, I can't dodge. I'm not really going to dodge a Chaos Warrior out or a Beastman that's just, just more like I'm going to have to lay blocks to get him to do that. So I have to roll more dice. I, I probably would have went for that route, but I don't know. Um, so, first thing, we're going to back up. Uh, who's over here? Seth is over here. We're going to back him up with Griffin. Now, don't get me wrong, this War Dancer can potentially surf him, but I think I'm actually going to get to lay a block on him in a second. We're just going to try and get the uh, the defense kind of set up beforehand. He really just doesn't have enough players to effectively do this. Get this, maybe my assists. First, we're going to knock him over here. We need a pal, guys. We need a pal. Well, I don't like this. I don't like this at all, actually. Uh, can we go around the back side? That's too good for us that way, and it doesn't even help. Um, standing list doesn't do what I want. I just kind of want this word answer to go away. Double skull, that, that time. Okay, well, let's push him and follow. On cue. I really should have just jammed him up in here. That was, that was the play. That was a mistake. Big mistake on my part. He didn't really do anything. And he's going to still get the two die on him right there. So. Yeah, I should have jammed him in here. It would have kind of limited these guys movements and blocks and now he can make this and just kind of kind of squirt out on this side and I, I don't have the movement to really stop them so definitely a uh, I got a little overconfident based on well I'm up to nothing like I'm not worried about losing but I should still play better Keep in mind, he still just has what he. They just still. What's his man actually in the coach name? So I'm gonna go with this. He. Oh look at that! Oh look at that! Skull. Stunned. Thank you. Okay. Safe moves first. Stand this guy. Up. Uh, gonna move. 
this player back a little bit, I guess. The catcher? Yeah, it's got touch. So not a lot you can do with that. Okay, so the catcher in scoring range. It is with no other movement, so. Here. And Griffin has already chosen block for his uh, skill up. Okay, actually, now we're going to come in here on this. Still no injuries, no SPP from injuries at all. Frustration. Okay, we can mark that guy. We can definitely mark that guy. We can go all the way over here. Oh, he's got dump off. Yeah, he can't dump off that. Thing. Goes nowhere. Okay, you do that. Can I intercept it? I cannot. So skip. That was an inaccurate pass. Still skip. Oh. Fifty percent pickup. I don't like it. Uh, let's move this guy over here. If I get an extra block there. Um, so he's like marked by a billion people. I don't think I take the reroll on that one. Both down it. Hope they don't die. Oh, Brian, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. No long term effect. It'll be okay. We're okay with this. Ah, now Griffin said, but mighty blow if you want to kill her free safety. I mean, I don't not want to kill her free safety, but he did say block first. It will add consistency. We're going to go with that first. So he's got no rerolls and not many players standing uh, against a lot of power. So I think we're okay. When there's a one die, they can go for it with a one. <laughs> okay, push. Where are you going to push me? Into a double red die. Thanks. I'm okay with this. Actually, I think it's into a one die. What? Oh, that's not the one with Frenzy. The one with Frenzy's right here. I'm stupid. Sorry. Sorry. I'm very not, not bright sometimes. It happens. So I've got three turns to score, so this turn I'm going to make sure I get somebody like kind of down there in scoring range. And he's got two players still stunned right now, so they're around the ball. So if I pick the ball up, I can kind of dip out. Still have two rerolls for three turns. Not the worst. Oh no, he failed. He's also like completely crowded the ball over. I got almost no way of picking it up. I mean, yeah, I'm going to just block this dude. But don't like it. Uh, hit him there. Oh, gosh, that's awful. I 
actually. Hold on. I go here. Block. Moving. Oh, that is a dodge. Okay. Um. Remove. Pick and here. He just goes out of bounds, right? Yep. Hoping that's how that worked. And it was. Okay, they're marked. He's kind of marked. Let me pick the ball up and dip out over here. Picking the ball up is key. I'm going here. Yeah. Oh, it's catcher. So if I hit him, and I can put assist there. Ah, oh, he's got dodge. Oh well. Put him here. Hollow. And just looks like we're gonna kind of stay here. That's fine. Be right back. I uh, apologize for a little house issue. Um, got the ball. A lot of players versus not a lot of players. Most of the players are on the ground. Bonus. Uh, definitely can't lose this game. Working on a 3-0 win. Possibly leveling up. Uh, another player. Has anybody got three? Who's on three? Nobody on, I thought it's my, oh, I've got a Chaos Warrior on three somewhere. Oh, got Casey, Executioner, is on three, so we're looking for that. Should be, should be pretty good. I think he's just timing out, okay. Seth and try and get one more person that gets MVP that can just, just go for it. So uh, he is kind of checked out. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I guess we'll go down here.
pile. Stay. Oh! Didn't really want to kill him. Didn't want to kill the man. But level two. Got to apo that. I mean, you gotta apo your level two guy on like turn fifteen. What are you doing? Did you leave? Did he leave? He's dead, Jim. Not, not, not the best. Okay, nobody else is really doing anything. We're gonna put him here just in case stuff goes sideways. Also, in case of a sideways. And we're gonna go for it. And go for it again. Okay. So he can go one, two, three, four, five, get in the end zone, and then go and hand it off to him, which would level Casey. So that's kind of. Oh, wait, hold on. Ponce could level with the, with the knockdown. The injury here. One time. Nope. Okay. Well, this we get two die here. Okay. And that'll work. It's a loner. Actually, don't want to injure here because, eh, I'm not. Oh, okay. Come on, stop, stop. Okay. Guy just lost his, his thrower. Not, not heartless. Didn't want him to lose his team. Okay. I don't know if he's just like tapped out or what. He has said nothing in chat, so. As far as I know, he's walked off from the computer. I don't. We'll, we'll see. But right now, with a reroll on the next turn, I'm going to put uh, Executioner, Casey, right there. I'm going to walk Seth right up to him and hand him the ball. It's, just, I mean, it's actually not the same because the catch for him is uh, a three plus, whereas the go for it is a two plus. But I've got a reroll, three plus with a reroll is pretty good. Oh, it's, is it my turn yet? Nope, so his turn. I think he just like walked away or he's just given up. So we're a three plus with the reroll away from leveling a Chaos Warrior and winning 3 0. Pretty big. If we wanted to be super greedy, I could try and pass it with Seth in case he gets the MVP, but I think that is definitely being pretty greedy. Pushing it a lot. So, uh, yeah, we'll just work on that. Another game. So, 10 seconds away from getting to do the play. I can literally not lay a block. Everybody's down. I'm not going to foul the guy. That's just, I don't get SPP for that. I'm not, I'm not about that. So, we'll see. And clip. Go stand in the end zone. And hand it to your buddy so he can look. Hey, hey, nope, nope, you catch that ball. Hey, there's the level. Now, as he fumbled the first time, it hit me. It would have been statistically better. I mean, it doesn't really matter. But uh, to hand it off to him where he was, because there the scatter cannot go out of bounds. Whereas when I put him in the end zone and then try to hand off to him to scatter three out of eight, goes out of bounds. So was just worse. And they have they have they have one turn to score. Like they didn't have anybody to score. They're on the ground, but just saying for future reference, pay attention to that I guess. Um, yeah, I don't think I don't know if they can get any two die blocks on me like this. Single player. 
Uh, that's right. Brian got hurt. It's okay. Brian's not not hurt for long. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. It's great. It's good. We like it. Okay. Uh, confirm setup. Hopefully he won't just time out. And he's not literally just just gone. So. Uh, I've yet to get a many comments on Twitch that weren't people in the league or any comments on YouTube yet. Uh, granted, this could be it for a long time. So who knows? But is this something that anybody likes to watch? Who's my blood bill people out there? People that play Warhammer. Just people that like football. That like, you know, just games like this. It's a fun game for me. Uh, like I said, some of my friends, from Magic playing friends from Tuscaloosa got me into this game, they need another person for the league. Uh, I'm in the second season for me playing. Uh, in that league, I've got Dark Elves. I'm in the playoffs. Playoffs start tomorrow, actually. So, wish me luck on that. Uh, whenever you see this. <laughs> but, yeah. I, I think this guy, once again, his coach name is Larry Man Dime. So, whatever. Uh, I think they have officially checked out and they're just sitting there uh, trying to get, they're just going to get their MVP bonus. But yeah, they probably shouldn't have left since their thrower died and they, they were sitting with an Apo, didn't use it, and he just died. So, um, Who got that SPP actually? Pickens. Way to go, Pickens. Knock that joker out again. So actually, just killed him. Just killed him. I'm guessing that's Casey, actually. It's got to be Casey. Uh, yeah, I'll take Block Honey. That's no problem. You can have Block. Hey, X Rear Oil Candy. It's great. He's literally just timing out. He's roping. So. Yeah, I'm hoping I get a magic MVP that levels up either Pickens or, or Michael. Let's see who else we have. Nobody else got SPP? Like I said, I'm missing two players. Had two deaths in the first game. So uh, Also, Brian, he scored. So if he gets MVP, wow, this is going everywhere. Um, if he gets MVP, he'll get a level as well. I'm definitely taking block with Griffin. Um, <laughs> and I'm going to take block with Casey because he, he asked. So. Like I said, I'm giving everybody like three choices on their, their skills. Like I said, unless it's a stat up, I'm going to take a stat up on, on certain players when I can. But yeah, we'll do that. No problem. Get to play next game with two players with block and possibly a third. Now, if anybody else levels up, like, I'm hoping they say, yeah, take Mighty Blow because that's just fun. But having a little bit of block is, is always good, especially against some of these teams that are just made of block. And it's really gross playing them. Uh, so with this win, I'll get to one win, one draw, no losses. Uh, I've still got two empty spots in my roster. Hopefully I roll well uh, for the winnings and can buy back um, a player. It's between Darren and Jeremy, and I'll probably roll a die for that because... Blood Bowl, why would you not roll it out? Of course. And uh, Casey's in chat saying that if he makes it long enough, he wants to be Claw Palm. Of course he does, because that's the best. All right, game over. Let's see who gets MVP, and we'll, we'll go from there. I can't really reroll that, but 
it, it's fine. What we'll go for? Sixty K. Uh, turn down and turn down. And Shane got MVP, so he's one pass away from leveling up. Got a fair amount of SPP this game. Level, level, oh, close. They're in there. Uh, dice. My catches were bad. Understandable. Passing bad. Understandable. My armor. Oh, that, not about that. That's not cool. Uh, block dice. Actually bad. Had way more skulls than pals. So, more buff down than Defender Stumbles. And Defender Stumbles against them is not that great. So, would they have... Uh, their block dice was atrocious. Of course, they took about four turns off there at the end. Uh, not many pals. And their D6s were actually a little, po little positive. Threes and fours don't really matter. More fives and sixes than ones and twos. So, anyway. Let's see if we can get in here to the league part. And level some people up. Okay, like I said, if it's a stat up, I will go... With the stat up, let's see what we get. Well, sixth, uh, well, he wanted to block. We'll go block. Seems good. Okay, now on to Casey. What we got, I would take. Oh, I take movement on him. Okay. Uh, block for Casey. Yay. on him so my new team uh, still only nine players uh, and I can buy a beastman um, I'm gonna roll a die to see who is what on that um, how can we get there? Uh, over into view. Okay, so one and two. Uh, well, one will be Jeremy, two will be Darren, and generate. And Darren's coming back first. Cool. Alright, so there's that. Gonna buy a player. I think he wanted the Mr. T head from back in the back on that last team, so we're gonna keep Mr. T head. Let's go and confirm person. Back to zero in the bank. Actually, not happy about that, but it'll be all right. All right. So yeah, here's the team. 1050. Still a player down, so I have a loaner for next game. Like I said, hopefully, we get at least 60k and buy Jeremy back. And we've got a bunch of players that are like we've got Ponds, Six Hill. Brian, Big Rich, uh, Pickens, all these people are MVP away from getting there. Seems good. Uh. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, we're hoping to get Jeremy back really soon. Hopefully after next game. Maybe level up one or two other players. Let's get another team like that that we can just kind of push around. That Honestly, he, he might have been a new coach. I don't know. But he was gone for like the last half of the game. But the game wasn't really in doubt by that point. Hope everybody enjoyed it, and I'll catch y'all later. Thanks. If you've made it this far in the video, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please click subscribe and like the video and comment down below on what you'd like to see in future videos. Thanks for watching.